This week's safety toolbox talk is in discussions about <clears throat> putting in concrete floors or tile floors, carpeting floors, and what tradesmen out here are doing the best they can to protect, of all things guys, their knees. Your knee is like your elbow or your lumbar spine in a sense where it's a bending portion of the body. And what we're finding out here in the construction industry is many tradesmen, whether you're a carpenter, laborer, cement finisher, tile setter, whatever you're doing, you're kneeling. And a lot of times what you're kneeling on, your substrate areas, there could be particulate, tripping hazards, whatever the case might be. And we're realizing that the majority of tradesmen are choosing not to wear proper knee protection. Now, as we get into this industry and we decide to work this industry for 30 some odd years, when you get into that 30 some odd years, you're realizing arthritis has set in, you've got some tears, your meniscus tear, an ACL tear, you may even chip a kneecap by simply kneeling down on aggregate and disabling yourself for a certain period of time. So this week, I want us to take into consideration what the scope of works are that we do and would it be best to be wearing knee protection? These guys are just simply placing concrete right now. At a later time in today, they're gonna to be kneeling down on this and finishing it. But yet some of these gentlemen here are wearing it all day long as they frame, as they seal the floor, as they fill in edges, because that's the best practice. As a fellow cement mason throughout the years, I would wear these knee pads eight hours a day to protect my knees. And that's what we need to start considering out there. Remember, be your brother's keeper. If you have a fellow tradesman working in front of you this week, today, and he's not wearing knee pads, shouldn't he be? Give him a little safety talk. Let's move toward protecting those knees better than we're currently doing. Let's have a safe week.